Hello there everyone, I'm Mr. Mocha Lover, and thank you for rejoining me here in the USA States Redux mod. Now, this is not where we left off yesterday, because basically, as someone pointed out, I could have chosen early on in the beginning to make it so that the world doesn't exist except for Americas. Well, I should really say North and Central America. So, basically, I replayed it up, to, up until the point of yesterday, about sometime in 1941, and but we're still in the Pacific States of America, but right now we're at war with Texas. And some United Mexican states, <clears throat> Colorado, I've already taken out Utah, uh, Old Texas Republic, the state of Wyoming, and some Mexican states, as you can see, as they've taken over uh, little parts of California, which isn't very good, but hey, regardless, that's what we're here for. So, I apologize, I should have realized that this mod allows us to have just the United States available, so, or just the United States and Mexico and Canada, and Central America, instead of having the entire world. That's my fault, so now we're done messing with, like, factions that join Europeans, so, actually, there are no other factions. Well, actually, yes, there are. The North American Defense Pact, and we have, of course, the Independent Republics of America, and then we have the American Union. So, my apologies, I really didn't mean it to do it like this, but it just kind of happened that way. I just, I don't know. I should have read the mod a little bit more closely, but I apologize once again. 57, so... Here we are, we're in a war, and, well, the Hoosier Empire is doing really well. The Wisconsin Empire is doing okay. New Germany, that is Pennsylvania. Of all things, that is Pennsylvania. But I did ask you a question in the last episode. What is the hottest place in America, or the United States of America? And that is in California, more specifically, Death Valley, California. It was like the hottest temperature there ever recorded. It was like 134 point something degrees. That's pretty hot. That's pretty hot, and you know, I'm not going to lie. I used to live in the south, and that was pretty hot, but... Ooh, that was, that's, that's gotta be pretty toasty down there. Especially during the summer months. But regardless, the next question is, you see this bear up here on the flag? For the Pacific Republic, but really the California flag. What type of bear exists on the flag of California? What type of bear? There's a lot of different types of bears out there, but specifically, what type of bear exists on that flag? Let me know in the comments below. Cool. But yeah... Changing the game here wasn't the best idea, and let's see, a couple other things. We've already have enough natural spirits. Actually, let's go over a few of them I've already done. Some of them I've not done, like fun recruitment centers. Let's see, to get to the point again, if you'd like to read about some of these focuses, I still haven't done all this stuff yet, like Relieve Nevada, I think we might have already done, uh, Relieve Arizona, as well as Relieve Baja. But to get to the point, we to, to get to this point here, once again... Let's see, we had to ask Washington, Oregon, and Alaska to join us, right? Oregon accepted. Washington accepted. Alaska didn't. So it took a while to get up there, and that's why we have such a big army. Because when you, like, ask them to join you, and they actually join you, then you actually get their army too, which is actually really, really, really cool. So that's like when we have a bigger army now. Just to keep you aware of what was going on. Let's see, you guys do this as well. Hopefully we can take back Idaho Falls, because that's actually a really nice spot to defend. As you can tell, because we're losing the battle right now. And if it goes down any further... Nope, we're done. Don't waste it, please. Don't waste your strength. We don't have that much manpower. Even though we are mobilizing, I did get to extensive cons conscription. And I'm probably going to go to all adult serve eventually, just because it's probably going to be necessary for us. And there goes our manpower. Ace pilot promoted, huh? Oh, they cut us off, huh? Well, that's not good. I mean, these guys 40 combo with two, so. Seriously? Why can't we win down here? Do they have air superiority? Oh, they don't. Seriously. Uh, it's probably mountains. Or hills, or desert. They have a lot of divisions down there, so, so be it. Wow, these horses suck. That's alright, though. They're only 20 combat with. Puerto Rican Empire declared one of the Republic of Guadalupe. Cool. <clears throat> So, come on, come on, guys. You you want to attack me, so... Oh, look at these guys. Not looking so good down there, huh, Texas? Actually, how's Texas doing? We're out of manpower, too. They're out of manpower, which is good. They also took over Mexico again. They actually formed the Mogollon Empire, so... I decided to give it to them. And they have their little, little shoot staff up there. I don't think they deserve that, but I gave it to them anyways, just because it looks a little better. Depending on your opinion. Now, Texas... Oil processing, good. Ooh, come on. Up and out. That'd be good. And we did get the 6th research slot, which I'll show you that 
Spirit as well. Let's see. It is 41. It's almost 42. Just going to grab this one. And then maybe some of this. <clears throat> we did get this one. Research efforts. But yeah. There's going to be a lot of resistance. Tennessee and Empire. Chichen it's an Empire declared war in Guatemala, which is nice. New army tactics. At this point... <clears throat> As much as I want to complete this down here, we need more manpower immediately, so we gotta encourage capitalism and small business. Capitalism is, is what made the US great and one of the biggest economies. We must encourage this and deregulate our economy. Cool. Damage garrisons goes down, which is actually pretty nice. We're already rooting out more stuff. Is there any way I can. I, I already am a spy master. Okay then. You know, just keep doing stuff like this. As long as they can't attack, even though we can't attack, or if they can't beat our defense, that's what matters the most. And what are we missing? Manpower. Wow, we're missing quite a bit of manpower. We got plenty of equipment though. It's pretty nice. Infantry stuff. Over here, we'll throw on some signal companies because we can. Maybe throw on some recon. Do we have enough motorized for this? We do, actually. Do we have enough for armored cars? Yeah, we do, actually. Nice. And we'll do some 40 combo with divisions too. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Not bad. Happy 1942, everyone. Hope you're having a great year. Let's get the M2 Carbine. Try to get more manpower at the same time. I'm not even making any divisions either. Yeah, we're going to need more planes for this. And actually, we're going to push these guys down for the south. There you go. Push them down. Like I said before, I really was, wish it was a way for us to, like, integrate states as time goes on. I mean, I don't see anything here that there's decisions to do so, which would be pretty cool, but... Hmm. Create an Asian section, huh? <clears throat> and we still have Hawaii, so they're still a puppet of us, which is good. Peace conference. Oh, there goes Indiana. We were looking so good at there earlier. There you go. Let's see if we can get some more planes, too. <clears throat> oh, we have no manpower, so that's gonna hurt. Hmm. Hmm. Good work on me. Building a lot of roads. Radar's not looking too bad. Go hop out Las Vegas. Go hop out up there. Not bad. <clears throat> cool. New Jersey is... Oh, I guess I was doing their thing over there. So they're getting more autonomy as well. Which is going to be good. Flying formation. Grab some more. That'd be good. Alright, so we've lost 30,000. They've lost 66,000. Especially Texas. But, you know, you wanted to go to the war with us, guys. I just wanted Utah under us again, so... Actually, if we keep taking more land. Let's go take more resistance. Hmm... <clears throat> Armored cars, eh? Let's try that. Oh, we got plenty of armored cars. Let's make sure we change it a little bit more. Let's see, you guys. Boom, boom. Now that should be pretty good. Now we're out of army XP, which really sucks, but hey, whatever. Texas is stretched pretty thin, which is fine with me. <clears throat> good, good, good. So half you guys over here too. Nice. Very good, very good. God, we could use more army XP right now. And planes. Cause we do have cast, which is really nice. Can you guys? Actually, yeah, you guys can. Get down there. Hmm. Nice. <coughs> My apologies, I had to clear my. I have to keep clearing my voice for some reason. Alright. Missing about 3,000 manpower still, so be it. Get to Casper if you can. Uh, if you could capitulate. Was this Colorado? No, it's Wyoming. If you could capitulate Wyoming, that would be pretty good, I'd say. I reckon. Now they start moving, you start attacking. We can win right there, that'd be pretty good. 
Let's circle Texas Division, destroy them. Pretty bueno. We're gonna raise the conscription level again, but let's go ahead and do fun recruitment centers. California has a large population. This could easily be used for military campaigns to solidify our position, and of course, we will need men to defend the bastion of democracy. Of course. Of course. And they're there. Great. New Germany, also known as Pennsylvania, has been uh, decrypted. I haven't done Texas yet, which is weird. Wow. That's a, a lot of yellow. Kansas has done... Oh, they took over Missouri. Holy crap. That's a lot of resistance. Wow, look at North... Wait, Union of Retribution. <laughs> North Carolina. Oh, look, look who it is. Look who it is. Mr. Pelly. That is... That is quite a wild flag. I'm kind of liking this. NC? Oh my goodness. State Michigan? Um... I don't think that's the right place, Michigan. <laughs> it took a little part of... Of all places, it's one thing if they took, like, northern Indiana, but, like, southern Indiana? Like, guys. Oh, what the heck happened over here? Hold on, are you a puppet of the Kansas? Oh my goodness. You know, uh, hold on. You actually have this as a core state. Whoa! Whoa. Sunshine Republic. That's kind of cool. People's Republic of Louisiana. State of New York. Whoa. Je me souviens. So instead of the communist version of that part of Canada, we have the uh, probably more fascist or even democratic path for them. Cheyenne. Carpenter. Keep taking stuff, guys. Oh, actually. Oh, we're over with Nebraska, too. Hmm. Still a lot of manpower, but what else is new? Alright, so let's let our guys move around a little bit more. Ooh, you can actually probably take these guys out now, finally. There we go. Push them in. Rock Springs, eh? So be it. Just go in if you can. Better radars. Always nice. It's 42. Let's grab some better artillery. Thank you. Still mobilizing, which is great, great, great. And Rock Springs should be ours. And that might be enough to capitulate them. Come on. Oh, come on, man. If we could take that tile, that would definitely cut them off. Which would be quite ideal. Where's the capital now? There they go. There goes Wyoming. Alright, go ahead and move on in, guys. See what you can do. Ogden. Get rid of these folks. That'd be great. Ooh, don't lose, please, please, please. Nice. So once again, I do apologize for this messy campaign in the future, because I do plan on playing this mod a few more times, at least a few more times, so... I will make sure that we leave it on states only. Because I don't mind beating up Mexico provinces, or Mexican provinces, as well as Canadian provinces, but when Japan and Germany get involved, it's kind of like, really, man, really? Oh. Let's grab more field hospitals, that'd be good. Awesome. Not too bad. Oh, are they taking more states? Yes, or provinces. Springdale? Oh, come on. Don't let them come back. Oh, we've been pushed even further south now. Mexicali, eh? Well, I guess technically we're still training our submarinos. What if I had you guys come on out and y'all did this? Does it hurt our fuel? How much manpower do we need? Oh, casually 13,000. Well, that's not bueno. Are we still mobilizing at least some more? At least we're mobilizing more. Too bad it's not like Old World Blues where you can do or have decisions where you can lower resistance. I would really like less resistance. Oh, you guys going there, you guys. There you go. Gillette. You can take them out. Actually. Go right there, you can take these guys out too. There we go. Alright then. Not bad. Not bad at all. Goodbye. So what we really need to do is get down to Texas. That's the, that's the main thing. They've got how many divisions? Up to 29. We've got 77, so it's a little unbalanced, but hey. They're in their own faction, so... Pretty good. They didn't need manpower anyways. But we do get more autonomy with our current setup, so that's kind of nice. We could do a general attack, but that'd be kind of very wasteful. Uh, 
I'm I'm spying something down here. Maybe we can make an encirclement of some sort. Some of these guys are 40 combat with, with the National Guard divisions. Just to let you know. Just to let you know. There goes another Texas division. Thank you. I wonder if we could race actually down into Texas, get to New, through New Mexico, and go straight for Austin. I kind of doubt we would be able to, but you never know. Could you guys actually? Yes, you could. Well, yep. The British Antilles, eh? Go there to there. We might try to get Moab. Mob. Oh, still mobilizing, that's good. Good. They don't have enough divisions that really hold their line, which is good. Capitulate Denver, maybe. Uh, you might as well try to go for it. There's a lot of little, oh, I guess, suburbs around here. Breckenridge. Ridge. Now we gotta definitely attack right here and circle three more divisions, which would be pretty darn nice, I'd say. Nice. And portable radios are cool. Invisible ink. Plenty of mil We have plenty of factories. Holy cow. Ooh, do that. There you go. Oh, we're getting attacked. That's not good. They take that. Whatever. Denver is captured. Aurora. More military factories. How about more guns? And actually, let's grab some more armored cars as well. That'd be very good. We got plenty of steel now. More light tanks. I'm making... Wait, am I making medium tanks? Light tanks? I don't see any medium. Oh, yeah, there they are. Cool. So, just in case, go ahead and put these guys down. There you go. They love encircling us. Boulder, thank you. Fun recruitment centers, thank goodness. And let's keep doing this. New, new artillery research, yes, please. Alright, this is looking pretty ugly, not gonna lie. Pretty ugly. Let's go ahead and come down here. You guys go down there. You guys go down there. Go down there. there, there. Boom. Aspen, eh? There you go. So Colorado's a little bit of an issue, but that's alright. Thank you. Go right there, actually. Thank you, Thornton. Let's go back to there. Very good. And what else do we need in Colorado? Colorado Springs? Oh, Durango, hey. That might be enough to capitulate them. Maybe, maybe not. Nebraska's actually completely open. Uh, Nebraska. I think the Cornhuskers? If I remember correctly? Cool, 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 cool. Snake along in there. That'll be good. Now, I'd like to puppet these guys, but we won't be able to since, uh, well, might be a little difficult to. Especially in, when we're trying to inform the United States of America, so. Alright. Good. Alright, guys, head on in. No, uh, y'all do the same thing. Head on in. Still got plenty of fuel. Durango, please go, go, go. Oh, they're probably going to keep that for now. Mm. Offer surrender to the coalition has become apparent that we're fighting a losing battle. The coalition ever encroaching on our last desperate defense, we make a decision. Do we really fight to the last man to sacrifice him, or do we surrender now and spare, spare more bloodshed? Uh, what? Defense Pact, Independent Republic Coalition. The surrender of the Col of Colorado. What? Wait, why do we get that? I think we're doing pretty darn well. Colorado's the one that's losing. Lamar. Oh, come on. There we go. Keep moving in. Don't let it move. Yeah, Texas is not looking good. Probably because they have a lot of resistance to deal with. Especially in New Mexico. There goes Durango. Get back, Denver. Get back, Westminster. La Junta, La Junta. Take Denver. Yeah, they, they win the battles, but then they leave. Doesn't, that doesn't make too much sense, now does it? Oh, come on, guys. Why do you want to just get encircled constantly? Nope. <clears throat> hey, there goes Nebraska. Good. 
Now those guys can come on back. I don't think we're finding anyone over here, are we? No, we're not. That's good. At this point, doing just full voice, full like attacks, but probably not very smart. But at the same time, like we need the guys to take land right now. Take land, take land, take land. We can smash through uh, the Colorado pretty quickly. I just want to smash through here quickly. That's all I want. Now they're coming through here pretty darn fierce themselves. But for the love of God, just take Colorado. It shouldn't be that hard. It really shouldn't be. And I'm not going to give up the attacks until they're done, so. Recovery rate. Let's grab that one. There they go. Finally. Jesus. That took way too long. Now everything else should be pretty much open up to four attacks. Yep, AFC, we got that down there. Good. So we've lost 85,000. They've lost three, a third of a million. Not bad. We'll do, be doing a little better. Hopefully. Because <clears throat> Texas does not, not have enough divisions. And how are they holding on with no manpower? That makes no sense. Oh, they have some manpower back. Okay. Well, so be it. Call off the attacks for now. We actually a little bit of manpower ourselves. Nice. All right, let's look at this. Get some more planes. Oh, that's nice. That is very nice. Any fighters? Oh, uh, we got a few. Boom, at least got that. Get this. And then boom ba da boom ba da boom ba Nice. Alright, so that's good. Shock and all. We're done with the land auction. Great. Let's come back over here. More military police. If anything, we need more suppression. Research new artillery and buy some tank licenses. Very good. After this, we shall grab some more engineers. And we're out of manpower again. Uh, but what else is new? Actually, do we have any other cryptology? New Germany? Oh, we had Colorado. Whoopsie. And Wyoming. Whoopsie. You saw nothing. Guns. Cool. Let's grab some more of this. Grab some of that. Thank you. Three. Two. Uno. Let's see what we can do. Now, we're not going to win everywhere, like down here. But we should win in some places, actually. Yep, definitely winning in some places. Lost 105,000. Tex is going to lose a lot of guys from doing this. Let's see, resistance. Oh, they actually, did they core this place? Oh, well, they got Albuquerque cord. A little unusual. That's nice. Let's grab some more of this. Get some better recon companies. That's very good. Wow, that's a lot of manpower. Can I get more non-core manpower? That'd be really nice. We got some nuclear stuff. It'd be kind of wild if we, as California, nuked other parts of the U.S. Kind of, sounds kind of fun, though. Alright. In the meantime, do we have armor divisions? Yes, we do. I might throw on some medium tanks. And if we're going to get some medium tanks, we might as well make them really large, shouldn't we? We got enough army XP to do so. Nice, thick divisions. If they're not thick divisions, why even have them? Alright, th go and throw on that one on there, and as well as... You know, let's grab some signal companies on these guys. Well, we're not going to use them yet, obviously. Actually, I'll convert Garrison's over to another one of these, as long as we can support it. Armored cars, yes, yes, we definitely can. Sonora's gone, that's good. Quite a costly war, but then again, Texas would be quite a costly war to capitulate them, so. They have a department, cool. And you know what? I'm probably going to release the United Mexican States, maybe, as a puppet. I think that'd be probably pretty good to do, because I don't want to deal with their resistance and such. Maybe we can get their manpower, so. I'm really just focused on America, not so much Mexico. Die bombing, good. Let's grab the next one. Direct ground support. Alright, at this point, Texas is. We've Everyone's lost a lot of guys. There's a lot of dead here. And after this, oh, there goes Wisconsin. Oh, state of Wisconsin. State of Kentucky. Wow. So that's the good as next, I guess. Saskatchewan operative captured. Very cool, very cool. Uh, fighting through Mexico really sucks, but it's a necessary evil, and let's do economic initiative. A plan proposed by Frank Miriam will bring us new ways of making civilian goods. Let's hope this can help our industry. Probably we'll be able to. Come on, guys. Wait, why'd, you, why'd, why'd you all stop? Maybe you already got your objectives done. Maybe that's why. 
Go ahead and hold. Stop wasting lives. Is that the French? That's Sinaloa. Wait, why do you guys still... Uh, uh, just reorganize yourselves first. Stop wasting lives. There you go. Oh, more military factories? Sure, why not? Are we missing anything? Light tanks, actually. Alright. Not bad. Not bad. We were making some anti-air, which I said we might make, but we'll see what happens. Armored guards, 4,200 is still left. More garrisons on them, then. You know what? We'll use nothing but this stuff, then. 1,300, not bad. Now, this shouldn't increase the amount we're using right now at all. If anything, it should increase the amount of suppression we actually do. Yeah, that's all we can afford. That's fine. All Texas Republic? Well, let's go ahead and clear this guy up first. And we'll have one big old great battle and push into Texas. Well, we already are. We already took the panhandle, so. <clears throat> and here. Oh, actually, that's when we gotta do the other stuff down south. Focus Street. Let's go ahead and go ahead. Military police is nice. Oh, maintenance companies would be pretty good as well, too. Yeah, Mexico, kind of a pain in the butt, but... Uh, guys, you have orders to go. I don't know why you refuse to go. Alright, so, if you refuse to go... Uh, it's, it's annoying sometimes they just refuse to do anything. Come on. Alright, let's see. 42. Anything else? Signal companies? Sure, why not? And... That's extreme environmental training, why not? Will you go now? Yes, you will. It's very weird sometimes they don't go. Very, very weird. Organization. Is he learning anything? General wait and see. Yes, he is. He might become an infantry leader before we're done here, so maybe wait and say what happens. Go to war for the Badlands, which are a very nice place to be at. Let's go and help. Oh, they actually have tanks, huh? Maybe we should use tanks. I could save on some manpower. Doing pretty well in manpower, even though we are barely still mobilizing. Come on, come to Fort Worth. Go straight for Dallas. <sighs> Fighting through Mexico sucks. It really sucks. Come on, guys up north. Take them out, take them out, take them out, take them out. I'll probably start converting some of our cavalry division and become tanks. That's probably the way forward. Come on, take Austin. Good. Fall of Awesome, one step down, three to go. Oh boy. There you go. Hey, Sinaloa's gone, that's good. Probably lost about 200,000 guys. Yep, a little more than that. United Mexican States is gone, good. Economic Initiative, that's also quite bueno. Let's do, ooh, what's this one? PSA Armed Forces, we've done that before, but that'll help us out. And gets a little more recruitable population. Houston is now the capital. Straight through Houston. Because <clears throat> once everyone, once Houston's gone, or once Texas is gone, they all capitulate. Great. Come on, Cyprus, Baytown, I've been to Baytown. Galveston, I've been, oh, actually Galveston's an island, they're not actually supposed to be, well, they're technically, they technically are connected, but. It's not actually just an island, of course San Antonio would be last. I've been to San Antonio once or twice, if I remember correctly. Alright, even though it's, we're kind of wasting lives, the lives, they're there for a reason. Yeah, there we go, finally, woo! Took us about 28 minutes to get these all, guys all done. Alright, state of Wyoming. Take all states. There's still going to be a lot of resistance, but that's alright. State of Nebraska, take all states. Let's see. I'm going to go ahead and puppet the United Mexican states because it seems like it makes the most sense. And, because you're my subject, I'm going to give you every, give you all of this because I don't really care about this part. There you go. Colorado. Thank you. Not bad. Uh, were we fighting these guys? People's Chihuahua? Maybe, maybe not. Now, hopefully, they can form Mexico if we keep giving them more stakes. We'll see what happens. We'll see what happens. And was it Badlands over here? How, how much longer do we have? Till the night. Ah, oh, it's not too bad. I was going to justify North Dakota then. People's Republic of North Dakota. Kind of a cool flag. 100 days. Wow, that takes quite a while. Uh, anything else? 400 some factories. That's not bad. Nation building. Oh, yeah. More daily democracy support. Why not? 
We have plenty of political power anyways. We got 1.1 every day. Cool. Very good. And how many tanks do we have in supply? Light tanks are not bad. Medium tanks not so great. Let's get a little bit more first. Direct ground support. And let's go with... I usually choose the one on the left. Let's go with the one on the right. Three. Two. One. Let's go ahead. Shouldn't be too bad. Especially now. And they'll go to work. Bismarck. We'll take out Land of the Living Skies and maybe People's Republic of Nunavut. Very cool. And Kansas. Okay. It's a big nation over there. It's a big, big country. Now, I wish New Germany or Pennsylvania would take over Maryland because that's looking pretty crazy. Also, someone asked it in a couple episodes ago, does Washington have a unique focus tree? No, they do not. So, that'd be quite the challenge to reform America starting as them. But, you know what? I will be right back, and we'll be ready to go to war with North Dakota. Alright everyone, and we're back, and we're ready to go to war with the Dakota. North Dakota. Oh, and actually guaranteed by Sunshine Republic and People's Veracruz. Okay, well, whatever, I don't care. Oh, we, maybe we should stop training our soldiers too. Cool. Also, we're justifying on this big old Canadian province up here, under Peter Brown, and that's going to take, well, some two weeks now. And now North Dakota, well, they ain't feeling too good right now. I should throw on some more planes on our guys, actually. Pretty good. Let's see. Who is it down here? That we have to, are, we, are we fighting someone down here? Oh, no, just Florida. Communist Florida. Alright, well, whatever. Fargo, would anyone like to take Fargo? No? Okay. Okay, I'm just slightly more. There we go. And we're going to immediately start justifying on Minnesota. Or the Empire of Ontario. Empire. Ontario Empire. Cool. It takes 55 days. So be it. Whatever. Thank y'all very much. Ooh, can't take everything. That's one of the weird things. Like, even though I did all the, the effort here, you still can't take everything. But whatever. Whatever. Go ahead. Come up here. We gotta go war these guys next. Wow. Um... You know what? We'll do this. Calvary, you finally get to go down there. Do your own little special thing. You guys go up there. And then you guys go right there. Good luck. We do have one tank division too, so... Ooh, man, there's gonna be a lot of uh, things we gotta do. Then come up there. Very nice, very good, very good, very good. And just double check and make sure that we actually have these guys. Yeah, there we got it. Cool. And we need to go to war by the 29th, which is not bad. Oh, there's the Dakota State of Michigan, too. Oh, cool. Pretty good. Good job, guys. Eventually, we will improve all that stuff there. We got planes, maybe air bases, recoilless rifles. That's kind of cool. Grab some stuff down there. Ooh, and eh, it's a little bit ahead of time, but at this point, it doesn't really matter. Field Marshal, plastic explosives are nice. Don't quote me on that. Plastic explosives, huh? Never enough explosives. All right. Ain't good by posturing. Very cool. And we need logistics companies, but I'm going to keep grabbing this already for our tanks, which I did increase a little bit more. Looking not too bad. We will throw on those. We don't support artillery, actually, on our guys, which is totally fine. But, oh. Yeah, you have four. That's not too bad. Anything else here? National Guard Division. Eh, I can barely using that. Garrisons are already maxed out, which is very good as well. Three. Two. Doesn't really matter to me. Let's go. I'm just going to have the infantry kind of do their thing. They should be okay without us. We need to play get all this stuff. You might be able to. Good. Fighters. Plus air support. Throw them on. These guys. Even more, please. Thank you. We're making no divisions. We have over half a million manpower, which is pretty darn nice. We're still mobilizing. Pacific States Armed Forces, funded recruitment centers. Ah, the Pacific States Armed Forces actually gives us more manpower, which is nice. We got new destroyers. I've been slowly doing some stuff down here as well. There's no description, which kind of sucks. New destroyers, no description, which kind of sucks. Expanding our dockyards. Sure, why not? Why not? Regina, cool. The Ontario Empire will be next. Even though Michigan is doing pretty darn well against them. Are they in a faction? No, not seeing too much here. American American Union, huh? Okay, well, whatever. More factories? Just don't mind if we do. I'll throw five more on there. We got plenty of steel now, at least for now. Maybe not forever. Get some more of that. That'd be kind of nice. Planes, light tanks are doing great. Anti-air. Oh wait, do we have one, two? Yeah, we got enough plane stuff. Throw a few more on. Throw a few more on. That's fine with me. Got plenty of rubber as well. Nice, good stuff. Oh. Don't forget about that. Forget night vision. Not too near. Might as well. All right. So how much more do we have to capitulate for these guys? Oh, they're almost gone. 
Yorkton. Thank you very much, that part of Canada. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Now, it looks like these guys are really ready to kill us off. Which is totally okay with me. As you guys, I'm sorry, but you had to come up to the icy lands up here and not die. Uh, let's go and do that as well. Yeah, there's a lot of areas here that need more infrastructure. Holy cow, it looks real bad. Hey, Buffalo Ridge, nice. Get that, and get that too. Cool. Let's go and go to war. Or start justifying on Nineveh territory. Guaranteed by some tree people. The Institute. Oh, that's what how's Massachusetts doing? Uh, of all people, of all places. Pioneer Valley, huh? This this Charles guy, look he do be looking kinda thick. There's a puppet of New Hampshire, okay, cool. Oh yeah, supplies really got off around here, isn't it? But we can go to war by when? August 26th? That's not too bad. We got some time. You guys... Oh, man. You are looking not good right there, son. Wow. Not bad. Army department. Cool. Cryptology. Nuclear reactors. We might need them eventually. Boom, boom, boom. At this point, just let time go on. Doesn't really matter. Uh, let's see. 45... Eh, do that one. Elite Forces, that's kind of nice. Go to war by... 26. So, Navy of the PSA. Cool. Looking pretty good. Let's go ahead and go to war. Did they fight us? Nope. Can we fight them? Probably. Nope, 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 nope. No one's joining the faction. Sorry, guys. Nope. Nope. We're alone, except for our Mexican puppet. Actually, I should send divisions down here to help these guys out too, but that'll be in the next episode. Probably there's only going to be one more episode in this campaign, just because once I throw on the fast justification war mod, it won't be that bad to justify other people. Even though it's really not bad right now. I mean, we could take out Cuba and like the Caribbean, but there's really no point to do that. I mean, it's pretty much all normal down here. Puerto Rico's done really well though. We might take him out. We'll see what happens. Kansas shouldn't be too difficult either. Uh, what are you guys doing down here? Whee! Wow. We gotta get all the way down there. Holy cow. That's gonna take some time. That's alright. Blueprint stealing. Not bad. Suicide pills. Love it. Yum yum. Maintenance companies. Logistic companies. Megan tanks even stronger. How many extra tanks do we have right now? Because we got 10,000 armored cars, which is awesome. 1,500. We can probably convert one more of these guys in. There you go. Good. Oh man, we're doing probably doing pretty darn well over here. Let's see. We lost 28,000. That's not great. Michigan's lost a lot of guys. Ontario Empire, well, yeah, it's pretty split between all of us, actually. Actually, yeah, 31,000. Not too bad. Oh, Michigan. I guess you're next. Well, yeah, let's get our stuff done first. Yeah, they've been doing really well. Naval rearmament? Three more dockyards? Sure, why not? None about sovereignty. They should be able to go to war with these guys pretty soon, though. Yeah, in about 20 days. It's not too bad. Suicide pills. They're out of manpower, which is good. We'll split the territory between us and Michigan. Michigan won't be too easy to take out, but that's alright. And then we'll almost finish this up. And boom, boom, boom. Hunt and destroy, and then we'll do combat unit destruction. Nice. Yeah, Michigan's going to be quite a powerful state to take out. Three, two, one. If you keep pushing in, they can't reinforce. And even though it looks like we can't reinforce either. Oof. Oh, Canada, can't you ever just build roads? Sometimes they do. There are a few more air bases just in case, too. Guys, other guys are giving their lives for you right now. At least you can do is just take him out. Go ahead on in. After them. Kansas Legion's got quite a few guys. We'll probably take out these guys. State of Wisconsin. And they're a puppet of Michigan, so we'll go to war with Michigan soon anyway, so. And.
Sand Doctrine is done. Air stuff. It's 43. Let's grab some of this. Even better cast. Love the cast. Nothing like the cast. Infinite cast. Mountain infantry. Pretty good. Psychological warfare. Armored cars. And we'll grab some half tracks. Why not? Good lord. Infrastructure here really sucks. Are they done? Oh! You have a mind of your own, don't you? Oh, no, you don't. They just, they just rebelled, it looks like. Naval rearmament. Very cool. And new naval tactics. Why not? P-51 Mustangs. Very good. And let's grab the carrier version of it. Grummelman. We're probably going to need to raise a conscription level again sometime. Okay, so when are they going to be done? Um... Oh, don't tell me we got to come all the way over there. Oh, my goodness. Oh, boy. Really? Seriously, man? Well, that's alright. We'll come down here and help these guys out, too. We'll take them out. No worry. Now, these guys... Well, we're suffering down here quite a bit. Supplies really god-awful. Nope. Nope. Sinaloa, you just took out my puppet. Like, bruh. No way. Alright. Eh, I can just beat those guys up too, because he can. Because he can. Because he can. Alright. Supplies really suck you right now. So if that's the case. Come on down here. Take him out. That'd be good. And you guys come down here and do. Oh, yeah, do them. Why not? Anything else? Region wide integration might be okay. War bonds? Yeah, might as well. Keep building. Keep on building. Nice. Well, Michigan's going to get a lot out of this. We'll probably take all the. Ooh. We could go to war them right now. We might wait a little bit. We might wait. 55 days. Nope. Alright, so you guys, not looking great. Not looking bad. But they're out of manpower. And they shouldn't really be able to do too much against us. Because they're out of manpower, and which is good. Establish Pacific States Air Force. Awesome. Not much there. Logistics 1, let's grab Logistics 2. Throw on the, these on our tanks. Oh! United Mexican States, thank you. Take all states, thank you very much. There you go. Mexican government, oh, uh, yes. Let them return. Armor divisions. And throw these guys on. Slightly less armor, but that's fine. Uh, if you really want to join, I don't really care. All right, so let's finish off these guys, and then we'll go to war with Michigan. Kansas op operative captured. Come on, Michigan, hurry up. Oh, you actually encircled some guys. Not bad. Not bad. Shouldn't take too much longer for them to capitulate. Oh, no, no, but. No, no, but. Hmm. Let's get the privateer. Elite forces. I'm starting to run out of things to actually research. Oh. I'll put. Why not? Combat unit destruction. Why not? Oh, Toronto has been taken. Yep, they almost got everything here. They might take Ottawa very soon. And that'd be quite good. Nice up tanks. I think we want to go to war. These guys probably attacking you like this is going to be a really bad idea. Especially with tanks and cavalry, but whatever. We'll find a way. Come on. Oh, they got back to Toronto. Come on, guys. Yep, they got Toronto back. That should be it. Because they already got Ottawa. Oh, yeah. There they go. Alright, so let's divide this up fairly fairly between us. <sighs> hmm... Well, you know, I'm going to take all the Canadian provinces, because we're already up here. But I'll give them Minnesota. Oh, what the heck? Oh, come on. And... Apologies for the clicking. There they go. Now they can have the rest of this. 
Seriously. I don't understand the point system with this. How much more do you need? There you go. A little better. Right, so you guys. Good luck with that. You guys. Go right there. And then you guys are just already down there, but I'm actually going to move you around. Go right there. You go to war by the 5th of February, which is cutting it pretty darn closely. I think we'll wait again to go to war with these guys. Maybe else we can move there fast enough. So we'll see what happens. Three, maybe? Two, yeah. One. You guys actually got there in time. You guys did not, so we gotta wait. Let's go and reach us to find Michigan, actually. It's only 55 days, not bad. Uh, you guys are not even down here yet. Holy crap, that's a lot of resistance. Let's go and go to war with these guys. I don't care. Go, 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 go. Move, 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 move. PSA Air Force, strategic bombing effort. Why not? Looking pretty good. And come down here and then go right there. That should be it, maybe. Maybe. Oh, they showed up there. That's not good. The invader, dragon. Why not? Good. That should be it, right? Do you still need Tempico? Looks like we still need Tempico. There you go. There you go. And boom. Half tracks, not bad. Let's grab the next one. Well, if we want to make any of these, go right ahead. Very, very good. Have everyone else train. Oh, yeah, they won't ever get Baja California, which is a shame for them, but whatever. Sinaloa, eh? Uh, actually, we're probably going to need some of these guys over here. Oh, they do have tanks themselves. And how much longer must we wait? It shouldn't take that much longer to go. Yeah, it's like three weeks. That's not bad. Let's go and build some infrastructure first. Which we're actually doing really, really well on. Yeah, the Canada's built up some roads, some some places. Radar over here would be actually very, very beneficial. Uh, build right there too. It's not bad. So we're slowly losing manpower eventually. Pretty normal. Make some parliamentary speech, huh? Nation building, exile forces. I thought we put them back in there. But maybe that's just me. And we don't need Hawaii, like, under us. I mean, they're technically, they are under us. But we don't need them integrated to actually form the United States, I believe. Because I don't see Honolulu here or anything like that. There we go. Alright, let's stop training. Let's see what happens. Strategic bombing effort. And let's go with purchase foreign aircraft designs. Nice. Okay, Mexico. What are you doing? You're just going crazy. I mean, we like Mexicans going crazy. Mexicans gone wild. Hmm. Now you have my interest. Are the mobile divisions up there? Yep, they are. That's good. After them. Uh, you know what? Fine, we'll help you out. It's fine. I don't really care. Oh. Wait, is this a rebellion? Why do they keep rebelling? Mexico. Never change, Mexico. Never change. Kansas Legion. We'll probably take them out. Let's go to Louisiana first. That's 100 days, which is totally fine. More. Hmm. Okay, there we go. Love your convoys. We've lost 10,000 versus 108. Wow. They have a lot of people. Yeah, Mexico just keeps falling apart. I don't like this. God dang it, Mexico. What's wrong with you? Why can't you just be normal? Get some more construction speed. Thank you. Just go ahead whenever you can. Nice. Another one. And let's get this one. Streamline line. Maybe I should just annex Mexico. That probably would have been a better thing to do. Big sadness. Oh, wait. And before I forget... State of Indiana, Jersey. No, we don't have them. Okay, they're gone. 
Not too bad. But I think we'll end the episode here then. We'll deal with the Mexicans, or I might just deal with them off screen. And maybe set them up to do okay. Ah, oh, they probably rebelled because... State of Indiana. Um, well, I'll integrate them. But regardless, I'll probably deal with them and make sure that they stop rebelling. But regardless, hope you enjoyed today's episode. If you did, consider leaving a like. Subscribe if you're new. Check out my Discord link in the description below. And I'll see you tomorrow as we might be able to finish this campaign. Thanks for watching. Have a great rest of your day.